Hello guys, this is Amos Stole Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play this beautiful song called Coming Home by Diddy Dirty Money. But the section I'm going to teach you is the Skylar Grey beautiful melodious section, okay? So it goes like this, give you a preview before we start learning it. So very beautiful, let's go ahead and break it up into about four parts so it's easier to learn. First part goes like this, right hand starts on the A, middle C is here, so go up to the A here, goes A up to D, C sharp, B, A, D, C sharp, A, D, C sharp, B, B, D, C sharp, A. Okay, that's it for the first part. Let's do it again, so it goes A, D, C sharp, B, a, D, C sharp, A, D, C sharp, B, B, D, C sharp, A. That's it for the right hand. Once you get the right hand there, left hand, we have four very important chords. These four chords in this particular order is the same four chords for every single part of this lesson. So it's great to remember it right now. So G major, which is G, B, D. Second chord is D major, which is D, F sharp, A. Third chord is B minor, which is B, D, F sharp. Fourth chord is F sharp minor, which is F sharp A C sharp. So take some time to remember these four chords right now. It will help you out in this lesson since every single part is the same four chords in this order. Alright? But anyway, once you remember it, the turn together goes like this. So right hand starts after B, G major by itself. After A, D major by itself. Right hand continues. After B, B minor by itself. Right hand continues. After A, F sharp minor by itself. And there you go, that's it for the first part. Let's do it again. So it goes. Alright. Moving on to the second part. Second part, right continues, goes D, C sharp B, D, C sharp A, D, C sharp B, B, D, C sharp A. Okay, pretty easy. Let's do it again. So it goes D, C sharp B, D, C sharp A. D, C sharp, B, B, D, C sharp, A. Left hand at the same four chords I told you in the first part, so that's why it said it's very important to remember those four chords, which is G major, D major, B minor, F sharp minor, okay? Anyway, the two ends together goes like this, so Ryan starts, after B, G major by itself, after A, D major by itself, Ryan continues, after B, B minor by itself, after A, F sharp minor by itself. There you go. Let's do it again. It goes. Moving on. Actually, before we do that, back to back, the two parts we've learned so far will be play like this. Moving on to the third part, Ryan continues, it goes A, D, E, F sharp, D, E, A. A, D, E, F sharp, E, D, E, C sharp. Okay? Yes. Okay. Let's do it again. It goes A, D, E, F sharp, D, E, A. A, D, E, F sharp, E, D, E, C sharp. That's it for the third part for the right hand. Left hand, we have the same four chords again. So G major, D major, B minor, F sharp minor, that you know very well. All right, so with those four chords in mind, the two hands together goes like this. So right hand starts, F sharp and G major together. After A, D major by itself, right hand continues. After F sharp, B minor by itself. After C sharp, F sharp minor by itself. Yeah, that's it for the third part. One more time. Together. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so back to back, the three parts of learned so far will be playing like this. Yeah, 
Okay, and something awesome happens. The fourth and last part is actually exactly the same as the first part. So we just save some time. So back to... There you go. And there you get finished. Okay, so back to back, all four parts will be played like this. Beautiful. So yeah, once you get the melody and block chords all good, um, you can keep it like this because it's pretty calm and nice already. But if you want to make it very grand and big, you can just add your own improvisations. Left hand for the chords, you can do like octave and arpeggio patterns. You can do like rhythmic patterns. That kind of thing. And then right hand, you can harmonize it based on the chords to make it thicker in texture. So you can do something like this. You can be like... Something like that. That was made up on the spot, but still based off every melody and chords I've taught you. It's just adding chords, improvisations, uh, and then the right hand is just harmonized it based on the chords. Okay, but yeah, hope you enjoy this. If you want to learn more nice tunes like this, go ahead, search up your favorite song on my channel. Just search your favorite song name followed by Amos Doll in the search bar and you'll find it. But as for now, that's pretty much it for today's lesson. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime and cartoon theme songs and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.